mainstream for that matter. It's Game 7 of the Stanley Cup Final. We are about set to drop the puck as both centers make their way into the dock. Don't you just love playoff hockey? Listen to this place. Let's get after it. Here they come. Great balance as he scoops it back up. A poor point. Oh, what a paddle save on the play. When that shot came quick and it was right out front, he had to be sharp. He'd be right on it and show his brilliant reflexes. And that goes off a of body. Moscow's gained possession along the boards. Oh, it's State scores on the rebound and puts it home. This is actually a tougher play than it looks, James. You have to have timing and an awareness to be able to get your stick on that rebound and then bury it. Not a lot of time and space available, but he executes perfectly. Kabarovsk's got the game's first goal as it finally comes in the back half of period number one. Yeah, it's been a real tight opening period. Uh, both teams back and forth, defensive style of play here. But James, they get the first goal of the back half of this first period. I expect things to open up now. A little more creativity to shine through. Good stand-up hit on the play. Fires it on net. didn't give up on this puck, James. He's caught out of position, but he does everything he can to attempt to make this save. It winds up going in, but his teammates will appreciate his efforts. More than half the frame has been played here. The next goal could be a big one as we are tied. Kabarovsk's won the draw. And now they look to make something happen from the neutral zone. That stretch pass is a beauty, James. Oh, what a stick save! Gets control of the puck here in his own end. Slick feed. Centering feed! And that's stopped! And he's pulled over to the ice and loses the puck. Tape to tape feed on the blue line. Penalty coming up. Kabarovsk's got the puck in the defensive end. Looking for space inside the D zone. Steps inside the line. There's the whistle, and here's the call. When your opponent doesn't have the puck, you can't interfere with their forward progress too much. You can cheat a little bit, James, but that's over the top. And the power takes to the ice their first chance to try to make something happen in this game. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Blocked by the defender. Nice play. Into the corner of the attacking area. Kabarovsk's got the puck against the wall. Off the club and makes the save. They've really got him on their heels here now. And that pass goes off a stick. There's the buzzer. Fans seem to enjoy that first 20 minutes. We'll get to the second period right after both teams get a chance to catch their breath. Teams are back on the ice. Both squads gliding into position for the start of period number two. Kamarovs won the opening draw and their power play rolls on. the puck and as both teams are now back at even strength the power play goes over on the opportunity specialty teams are so huge in any game james especially when it's tied you don't want to fall behind and have discipline really be a factor in the game the score! and the deadlock is broken as they take the lead well that's a 
huge shift, and you can see everyone standing up on the bench. They know how much it means, but it's the next shift that matters most now, James. You want to kind of push and put pressure on your opponent when they're down. This is what you call having a nose for the net. You take the initial shot, and you get back to the front of the net for your own rebound. That's a great tenacious goal. Kabarovsk's gone up by one here in the second period, and I like that jump in their step we're starting to see here now. We've really seen an uptick in their momentum in the last few shifts, and they're rewarded with that goal, James. They've got to continue to attack the net, ski downhill, and not be afraid to get to the paint. Picking up some steam at center ice. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Play blown dead, let's get the call. Well, he's frustrated with this call, and he's going to argue it with the official, but guess what? It's going to be a call. It's not getting changed. Another chance here on the man advantage. When you're not having success on your power play, James, you have to find a way to out-battle, out-work the goaltender. You gotta get into the paint. You gotta find a way to get to that puck first. Cuts to the paint. Denies him with the pad. Tries to feed it across. Into the offensive zone, down the right wing. Oh, what a stop! Penalty coming up here. Broadhurst getting called for two minutes here by the officials. They'll play some four-on-four. On a four-on-four, on four, you can expect all players on the ice when you're possessing the puck to activate. You have to be able to support the puck carrier, and if you're a defender, you know you're jumping into a lane going north. Moving into the attacking zone. Great read with the stick. And it gets it to the slot shot to make the save. And that's poked away by Draws. Moscow's got the puck now. Picks up the puck. Slides it diagonally to Dites. And makes the save. Puck is frozen, and we get a stoppage in play. Here's a blast. Misses! Here's a pass down low. Wicked pass! Denies him with the save! Denies him again! Tremendous pressure here in the offensive end. They're coming in waves! And the defensive team's got it now! Oh, what a hit there! Save made by the keeper! And there's the whistle as the goaltender will hang on and give his team a breather. Kabarovsk's got a hold of it along the wall. From the left side, they gain the zone. Shot! Oh, that just goes wide! Big save just as time runs out. Kabarovsk's coaching staff must be impressed with what they're seeing from their players tonight. Lots of pucks on net, and they continue to lead late in the second. Been a fun night in the barn as we bring an end to period number two, and there's still 20 more minutes of action to go. <sighs> Opening face-off for period number three is ready to go. And the puck is dropped, and we are underway here in the third. Well, Pounder, we've played more than 40 minutes now in this one. How do you view things? Moscow's first two periods have been a poor example of puck protection and possessing the puck, James. They turned it over at a high rate. They haven't supported it. They've been back on their heels, and as a result, they're chasing the game. Moves it up through the middle from the right. And he sprints to the base to get the extra attacker out on the ice. Play whistle dead. Penalty coming up. Uh, coaches hate stick infractions. They're real frustrating. You're right there. You're in and around the puck. You go fishing and you wind up in the box. Moscow's power play unit puts their hard hats on as they go back to work. Well, they earn this a power play, James, through hard work, and it's an opportunity to even the score here. They need to find a way to execute and get back to the even score. Goaltender hangs on for the whistle. 
a great goaltender is not giving up second shot opportunities and it's playing the rebounds to the corner. He does an excellent job here. Puts it on net and he comes up with it. In front of the net, the goaltender covers up for a whistle on the play. Moscow's on the attack. Grabs the puck here inside the offensive end. Let's it fly. Handles that one. There's the whistle as the puck stopper elects to hang on. Gish is gliding in for the face-off as this penalty kill will continue. Moscow's won the draw inside the offensive zone. Now let's see what they can do with it. And a delayed penalty coming up as he got tripped up. Here comes the sentence. Well, everyone has a role in this PK unit knows that they not only have to kill this penalty off and keep the game within reach, but maybe they can be opportunistic and pounce on a loose puck for an opportunity. Another power play opportunity coming up here. They haven't scored yet in the game on the power play, but no need to get frustrated. They all bring a different skill set. It's the reason why they're out there. Puck grab by Tron. Blocking traffic. Oh, what a stop with the paddle. Man, he was right on that puck. He knew exactly where it was. It was tight to the crease. He got out and challenged right away to make the save. Broadhurst crossed the line and came the zone. With possession along the wall. Teddy's gonna hang on and get a whistle here and a reset, much needed one at that. Oh yeah, I mean, they have just been taking control of in their own zone, James, and they needed this reset. They needed the goaltender to pounce on that puck. They can all collect themselves and get a line change. Kavarovsk's got possession here in the offensive zone. And he denied him there. Just misses. Oh, look at this. They are really starting to apply the pressure now. Here's a shot. Blocked in front. They have really got a settle down in here. Feeds it over. And the puck escapes the zone. They'll be forced to tag up. Moves it up. Great vision to see that stretch pass. Picks up the rebound and buries it home. Goalie looks frustrated now. James knows that you got to redirect that puck to a safe spot. Moscow's got the tying goal, and now can they find that go-ahead goal, Cheryl? They continue the momentum. They certainly can. They look like they're playing free, so they're moving their feet. They're being creative, and they're attacking. They're looking to win this game, not just keep it at evens. And he takes the pass. Quick shot! And oh, that one's turned away. And they'll cover it up, forcing a stoppage in play. Gotta love these moments within a game, James. It's tight. The game really hasn't opened up. You gotta play free, but you have to play responsible as well. Kavaros trying to make something happen in the offensive zone. Takes it into the slot. Moscow's won the draw, no go to work. Tease it up from the point. Oh, what a save! Kabarovsk's got a hold of the puck. And they continue to apply pressure here. We got a stoppage, let's get the call. This could be a game-changing call this late in the game, James. But guess what? You gotta figure it out. You can't control it. The call has been made. You just gotta get out there, and your PK has gotta do a job. The checkers send their man advantage unit out once more. Puck is dropped, and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. Moscow's got possession of the puck. 
And that slides right out to center ice. Moscow's got the puck against the half wall. The checkers have it behind the net. Takes the feet at the back end. Fans calling for a shot before it's too late. Oh, and serves up a little too sweet with that save. Just recognizing they're still short-handed here as they get ready for the face-off. Takes a shot, and he hangs on just as time runs out. And with that, we are heading to overtime. Get those OT picks in on social media, and we will see if we can find a winner next. championship. Just a great moment when you become Stanley Cup champions and then it's the all hands on deck team photo and I love this. I love that the Stanley Cup's in the middle with the entire group, the staff all wrapped around it just signifying that every player, every staff member was a key component to the win.